I'm Dr. Jen Harrison from drjenniferharrison.com. In this video, I want to show you how you can combine using the EFT tapping points with affirmations. So affirmations are, as you probably already know, are positive statements that are stated in the present tense around something that you want to create and manifest in your life. And by repeating affirmations, it helps to plant the seed in your subconscious mind. However, to make them even more powerful, it's great to combine them with tapping over the acupressure points that are used in EFT tapping. Now, this isn't true EFT, um, but we can take advantage of tapping over the acupressure points that we use for tapping for, for EFT because when you're tapping over those acupressure points you're sending a calming signal to the amygdala in your brain and other parts of the brain that uh, helps to calm the nervous system down it also helps with lower cortisol levels many other um, helpful benefits but the thing that's lovely is that when you're uh, balancing out and calming your nervous system then your uh, body mind and your subconscious mind uh, will be more receptive to these affirmations and it just helps you to manifest in, and create uh, what you're wanting to create and manifest in your life uh, more easily. So we're going to start off with tapping on the side of the hand point, sometimes it's called the karate chop point. And the reason we're going to start off with this um, while taking a few deep breaths in and out is that what can happen when we're stressed is that um, our, the body's energies um, or um, that consists of uh, uh, contain polarities, uh, sometimes those polarities get reversed. Um, it's also known as psychological reversal as well. And so that's why when we're doing uh, EFT tapping, we always start with tapping on the side of the hand point. So I'd like us to start with that as well today. So just uh, take a moment to take a couple of nice deep breaths in and out. So take a nice deep breath in and out. And out. That's it. Good. Take another nice deep breath in. And out. Good. So I've created some affirmations around wealth and financial abundance. And so what you can do is just follow along with me as we go through the tapping points and just repeat after me. Okay, so we're going to start at the top of the head. I release all conscious and subconscious barriers to personal and financial success. Eyebrow point, I'm so grateful for all the money I have now. Side of the eye, just as I graciously receive money, I'm also a generous giver. And under the eye, I choose to create a positive money mindset now. Under the nose, I release all conscious and subconscious barriers to personal and financial success. Chin point, I am so grateful for all the money I have now. Collarbone point, just as I graciously receive money, I'm also a generous giver. And under the arm point, I choose to create a positive money mindset now. And top of the head, I release all conscious and subconscious barriers to personal and financial success. Eyebrow point, I'm so grateful for all the money I have now side of the eye. Just as I graciously receive money, I'm also a generous giver. Under the eye, I choose to create a positive money mindset now. Under the nose, I release all conscious and subconscious barriers to personal and financial success. Chin point, I'm so grateful for all the money I have now. 
collarbone point just as I graciously receive money I'm also a generous giver under the arm I choose to create a positive money mindset now good and take a nice deep breath in and out great so by combining tapping over the acupressure points that we use for EFT tapping with affirmations it as I said it really helps to give power to the affirmations it helps to plant the seed in your subconscious mind which will make it easier for you to create and manifest uh, what you want in your life If you like this video, you may want to check out some of my online courses. Uh, one is called Jumpstart Your Success, which is a four module uh, online course that helps you to get really clear on what's working well in your life, what's not working well in your life, identifying your strengths, and helping, also, uh, helping you to get really clear and focused on what you want to create. Uh, and we look at eight key areas of your life. Uh, then there's also my signature system which is called how to transform stress to success and so I take you through a number of stress processing and stress management techniques uh, as well as helping you to get really clear on your goals and taking action steps to actually um, actually achieve your goals not just create them uh, and uh, there's uh, uh, lots of other things uh, in the program as well uh, including helping you to uh, move through roadblocks that inevitably come up uh, when you're you're trying to take yourself to the next level. So for more information on those courses and other courses that I have, uh, just go to drjenniferharrison.com and click on the courses menu tab.